Hello friends! I know that this is the first time you've seen me in, well, not even really seeing me, but hearing me in a year and a half. I am back. I am here. Um, it's been a long year and a half. Um, I'm not going to get into that in this video because it's, it's a long story. Um, so today we're just going to focus on a cash stuffing video. Uh, and through this cash stuffing video, I will explain like what my channel's going to look like from now on, um, because things are going to change. Things have changed in the last year and a half. And so I'm here and this is just what m my mind can handle. And so that's what we're going to do. Um, so for now on, we're going to be doing cash stuffing videos and then possibly some other, you know, like laundry videos, things like that, but probably no cleaning videos, um, no, nothing like that. I probably will be doing a sit down video uh, for the next one. Um, but for now, yeah, this is what I'm going to be doing is cash stuffing because I need to get some money saved for life. Uh, things have gotten really expensive in the last year and a half. And so I feel like I need to start saving money to get back to where I need to be. Um, so yeah, let's just get into this video so that we can get stuffing these beautiful uh, cash envelope binders. Um, and I will go through each of the things that I got because um, this is my new setup for my cash envelopes, which I'm really excited because if you've been here before, if you've seen it before, I do have a couple of cash stuffing videos. Um, some of them I made cash envelopes with paper and uh, packing tape. Um, so we've come, we've come a long way since then. And I think that this will be, um, this will be great. And it'll help me do what I need to do. Um, so the first thing I want to address are my crystals that I have here. Oh, sorry, I just hit the camera. <laughs> um, I will be featuring some different crystals. Now, I understand that not everyone believes in this sort of thing. Um, if you just think they're pretty rocks, that is great too. If not, I am going to be telling you about their properties. And um, like I said, whether you believe it or not, that is your own opinion and that is okay with me. We can all just uh, agree that they're just pretty rocks, if anything. Um, and yes, this is a hobby that I have picked up uh, recently and I am loving collecting pretty rocks. Um, so the first one we're going to look at, and I'll go faster through these as the things go on. I just kind of want to explain. So the first one is this citrine uh, crystal and I did want to like read the thing. I don't know if I will or not, but it just kind of helps. This one I know for sure that I will definitely be keeping in the videos at all times. So I figured I would tell you what they mean. Um, so this one says, light shades of citrine are thought to govern the physical body. Darker shades are thought to govern the spiritual aspects of life, carry the power of the sun and is powerful cleanser. Good for healing, depression and fear and nightmares. Enhances individuality, motivation and creativity. Promotes calm and emotional balance. Um, it also is good for money and abundance. And so that is why it is going to stay here where I do cash envelopes. This is an amethyst. It is good for calm and anxiety. And that's what this one's for. Like I said, I don't know if anyone actually cares about that. Let me know if you are interested in knowing about some of the other crystals I have. Um, I have lots of them and we can, you know, I can pick a different one each time and I can go over it with you. If not, it's not a big deal. We'll just have pretty rocks uh, in the video. So let's get started with this cash stuffing. So what I'm actually going to do, put this down here, 
um, is I have this little coin thing, which I usually have in my purse, which I'm not going to be stuffing anything in today. Um, so I just pulled this out because it's a lot easier to get the coins out than with it in here. But I will kind of show you what my purse looks like, or my wallet, I should say. This is my wallet that I usually, or that I keep in my purse, and this is what I carry with me every day. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take these coins out and put them in this jar off camera because it's really loud <laughs> and I don't want to blow your eardrums out. Um, but yeah, we've got some coins in here and I'm going to put them in the jar. Okay, so as you see now, I have the coins in the jar. So we're just gonna keep this back over here and put these back up on my little coin jar. So this is empty now. So we can, okay. So I just covered up my credit cards and stuff. But yeah, in here are some, some pockets that I have, or little things I have credit cards in. Uh, these are cards, so like my Costco card, my library card, gift cards. Those are the things that are going to, that are in there. And then I have a Costco envelope, coins, groceries, uh, eating out, receipts, because I save my receipts and I scan them on the Fetch app uh, so that I can get um, gift cards to Amazon and things like that. And then this is miscellaneous. So this is if I need to take money to the bank, bring money home from the bank. Um, I have to pay for something miscellaneous so like I have a doctor's appointment and I need the money for the copay I can take the money out of my sinking funds put them in there so I'll have it um, but yeah that is my wallet that I um, that I keep in my purse okay so let's get started on stuffing our cash um, so this is my cash for today get this counted. Now this is not a whole lot. Um, things are going to be very low budget. So yeah, probably won't be stuffing too much throughout my videos, but this I believe is like $120 or something like that, but we'll count it and find out. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 105, 110, 11, 12, 13, and 114. And we'll get these put in our little cash tray here. Make it look all pretty. Now all these bills look absolutely horrid, so I'm not even gonna try to make them look pretty in the cash tray because they're just all horrible. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, let's start with my high priority sinking funds and get those started here. Um, and today I decided to do like little sticky notes of what needs to go in where. Um, and I do have a little bit of cash in here already that I put in here a couple weeks ago. Um, but yeah, so first things first is medical. And it is getting $10. So we now have $20 in there. And then we have our new puppy, Luna. And in the video of me explaining life, I will explain about little Miss Luna here. She's gonna get $10. So now she has 10, 20, 21, and 22. And, uh, I am trying out a budget sheet. I'm only gonna do it for Luna for now. We'll see how well that works out. So after we're done, after I'm done filming, I'll fill this out. 
All right, next is Christmas. And it's going to get 20, oh, 20, and five. So it now has 20, 30, well, my brain, 20, 30, 35, and 40. Which I know doesn't seem like a lot with it being the middle of May. But I'm trying to get something in there. And then emergency. So this is my emergency fund. Um, savings. Just money I can collect just in case I need it. And this is getting $32. which is, um, I didn't have anything in it before, so we have 20, 30, 31, and 32. And then the next is home. And this, of course, is just for any sort of home decor, um, home projects, anything like that. And that is getting $5, which is its first $5 in there. And then car maintenance is also getting five dollars. And then kids um, is getting two dollars, which this is just this isn't like a savings or anything like that. This is just if they want a snack at the store or you know they need money for a field trip, things like that. This is one, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, and that is all of my priority sinking funds. My high priority sinking funds, I should say. And then this one is my low priority sinking funds. Now we're only going to be stuffing two uh, envelopes in here today. Um, so let's go to self-care. Mama needs to get her hair cut, so that's what we're gonna get stuffed in here. And it's going to get, this said $10, um, but I did actually have an extra five um, from my grocery money. And so I'm just going to add it to here. So this is actually getting $15. I need to save up about 150 to get my hair done. And then the next one is my husband, and he's going to be getting $10. So he now has 11 And yeah, that's it. And I was just going to go through the different folder of different envelopes here. Um, so eventually I would like to be putting stuff in month ahead, but right now that is just not a high priority for me right now. Um, I do have a savings envelope, <clears throat> but like I said, I'm sort of doing um, emergency as my savings envelope. So I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this or not. Uh, maybe I'll use it for something else. We'll see. Um, I would like to start getting rid of some debt, which I know this is like the point of cash stuffing, um, but I've got to figure out some things first before we can start doing that. And then fun funds is just for like family adventures and stuff like that. And then uh, this one I will probably be stuffing soon because me and my husband um, are going to be celebrating our 20th wedding anniversary in a year and so I would like to spend the next year trying to um, accumulate some money for that. Um, but yeah, that is my uh, low priority sinking funds. And that is all of our money. It's all empty now. Um, I, I really do hope that you guys enjoyed this uh, cash stuffing video. I really hope that, yeah, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> 
but I do really hope you enjoyed this video. Again, definitely look out for these videos. So I'm going to be doing these twice a month because my, well, every two weeks because my husband gets paid every two weeks. So for me, that's just like the most logical time to stuff in the envelopes um, because we're kind of low income right now. Doing it weekly is just not, um, it's just not possible at the moment. So every two weeks is, is going to be what it is. Um, but I will try to put maybe a video in between, maybe like, like I said, like a laundry video or a fold with me or a laundry chat, you know, maybe do like a Q and A. I am going to be doing a sit down video, kind of explaining where I've been, you know, things like that. Um, but yeah, so definitely look out for that. I'll probably have that up next week. Um, I'm hoping to have the cash, just all my videos up on Sundays. That's just the most easiest for me. But yeah, that is all for today. Um, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Definitely go down and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye.